A Taste of South Tampa returns for the 16th year. The Taste of South Tampa is an annual event hosted by the South Tampa Chamber of Commerce, and it is a day of fun in the sun while enjoying food, beverages, samples from South Tampa's best restaurants. And today, Tanya, South Tampa Chamber Board member, is here along with Andrew, the owner of Joe and Sons Olive Oils. Welcome, ladies. How Thanks are you? Thank you for having us. So this is like one of those events that I just feel like showcases everything that South Tampa can be. Wouldn't you? I mean, you're smiling already. Is that how you describe it? It's my it? favorite day of the year. I love yeah. to eat. And so to have 25 restaurants and some local, you know, companies there, it's a beautiful day. And of course, I can tell you why people like myself want to go out and enjoy the day. But businesses, why did you guys want to be involved, Andrea? So um, we're not a restaurant like many of the, the restaurants that will be out there. We're actually um, a, a tasting and tap room and retail store. Um, and we're going to be sampling out one of the recipes that we have in our cookbook. Mm -hmm. So um, and using, of course, some of our, our products in that. I love this because, by the way, let's talk a little olive oils and things like you were saying. You just make things a lot better. So you're able to kind of show off what you're able to do, which you're going to exactly. do here today. What are you going to be whipping up as an example? So this is a super simple orzo pasta salad, which uh, we includes our Eureka lemon olive oil um, and grapefruit white balsamic. And then we've also got a marinated grilled chicken also using the lemon olive oil and our oregano white balsamic. Well, let's start mixing, shall All right. we? Oh, we All right. Well, what we have here first is um, I've already um, cooked my orzo pasta and drained it, and it's cooled down. I'm just going to add um, some canned chickpeas that have been drained. I've got some sliced uh, tomatoes here. You can use the grape tomatoes. I like to use the ones that have kind of the fun colors because it just makes it really bright and beautiful. Then we've got some chopped red onion, which everyone that has come in here is asking like, oh, what are we making today? I mean, it really does smell fabulous. And I feel like this is the perfect dish to go with the day of the fun and the sun that we were talking about, right, Tanya? Absolutely. And what's wonderful, wonderful about this too is when people make it at home, um, this was just um, adding some fresh mint, some basil, and some parsley. Um, but you can make this for picnics or barbecues. Oh, it yeah. doesn't have mayonnaise. It's not a mayonnaise-based pasta salad. So um, it can sit out at a you know outdoors in a barbecue or so, um, so we're just going to mix that up and I'm going to go ahead and add my uh, see this is where I'm not going to lie like all of your olive oils like it is there's so many good flavors that it does get overwhelming so what are you doing because I see are we doing a combo yep so I'm doing this is the grapefruit white balsamic Oh, it and, so, good. Um, so it's nice and citrusy. In our cookbook, though, we give you all sorts of options. So you can make this with even maybe if you don't have these particular ones at home, we give you options of the other ones that you can use. So sometimes I'll make it with the Sicilian lemon white balsamic and Milanesa gremolata olive oil. Which, by the way, I'm actually holding the cookbook now just to give you an idea. You did you did bring the goods here for the more of the recipes. And when it comes to just being able to share these samples out, share what you're able to do for the company. Um, what does an event like this do for you? Why do you want to say yes to something like this? Well, we love being out in the community and um, and and having people sample, you know, what we've got. Because uh, sometimes people wonder, like, how do you have an entire store on <laughs> olive oil? And and this is a way that they can see and understand exactly what, what we have. Well, and, and getting back to the event itself, of course, we've got the food, we've got the beverages that we touched on. You also have even games. Isn't there even some putt-putt golf I was reading? There's a three-hole a three <laughs> a whole mini golf course. Uh, there's three stages of live music. I mean, beautiful weather. The beach is right there, the ocean. I mean... It's, it's going to be a lovely day. It is. Of course, we were talking about it. it's all happening at the Tampa Bay Garden Club right there on Bayshore, which is a gorgeous spot there. Mm -hmm. So are we now we're, we're, we're doing the final touches here. We're just doing a quick marinade oh, for the oh, chicken. Because I was going to say, I don't know if you could tell, the chicken was actually on the stove as an example. And then you've got it even uh, marinating now to show I've us got, this step, yeah. right? So just um, some Dijon mustard, um, some of our locally made Cigar City seasoning, um, salt, um, and then some olive oil, of course. So just real simple, that's your marinade. You can whisk it up. I love how colorful it is. I am, I am hooked. And we already have a chicken breast over here marinating, so we'll just add this to it. But there we go. Yeah. Oops. No worries. Um, and then you can throw that um, in a grill pan or on your outdoor grill um, and just um, the flavor is just really infused into the chicken. And of course, the balsamic vinegar um, kind of breaks down that connective tissue and makes it nice and tender and moist. So really delicious and adds a nice little protein to the salad. I love it. And by the way, we are spoiled here. Here's the uh, finishing touch in case you hadn't been able to see that yet. 
Look at this one. This is the example that you're going to have too day of, right? Yep, that's what they'll be sampling. Good stuff. Well, one more time, we want to make sure, we were talking before we got started too, people do need to have their tickets before they show up, digitally speaking, right? Yes, you can purchase it at tasteofsouthtampa.com. Make sure you have it ready, and we can't wait to see you there. It's beautiful weather. It's our 16th annual event, and wear stretchy pants. <laughs> you know what? I got to tell you, that's a great way to end the segment. Good job, ladies. Thanks for being with us.